Hey everyone, here we are back for some more Super Mario World. In the last episode, whatever you want to call it, we successfully completed the Donut Secret House here, and we unlocked the path down there to that flashing object known as Star Road. So we're going to head there, uh, check out the levels, see what everything's all about there, and uh, let's just get going, I guess. Why not? Looks pretty fun. Whoa! Whoa! That is indeed a star. And there's a smiling moon. That always makes things better. So, um, let's see. We have Star World 1. Let's, uh, check this place out. Uh, I have been here before, though, so I kind of recognize the area, so. Oh, good thing they give you a mushroom here. You wouldn't be able to do anything, because, you know, you gotta do your spin jump. If you were small, you wouldn't be able to break the blocks. Well, I already kind of know the secret here, so instead of just going through it the regular way, I'm actually just gonna take the secret exit right away here, just to kind of get through the, the area, so we don't have to worry about it. So you want to stay all the way to the right side, and continue down two rows here, and then you'll actually go right next to the key, right where we're at? engulfed by the giant blackness of the keyhole and that's exactly what happens which allows you to connect to this actual other star road so i think i'm going to kind of progress through star road kind of at the pace that you normally would in the game or to unlock the other i guess entrances so i'm going to just um just do this one for right now the first star road here and next time once i actually get to the star road from the main map that will take me to this star which we can go check it out though where it would appear so we know it's in the vanilla dome it must be you know in the level you know right to the right side of that so once we get there i'll go back and i'll play world two i think for star star world over here i'll play that one once we complete those levels later but no need to rush through those they'll um if you do do all those you'll get into the the mondo worlds i'm pretty sure if my memory serves me right, and then you'll be able to actually get into Bowser's back door to his castle, which is pretty cool. But for now, we'll just go back to the regular, regular Star Road and the Donut Plains here, and then we'll, uh, we'll just continue on through this area. So, what I want to do, though, is I do want to do the Donut Ghost House here, and I want to find the secret entrance, or exit, I should say, secret exit, that takes you to the special area where you can get Yoshi and all the power-ups and stuff. So, I'm going to play, um... Donut Plains 4 right now and see if I can get a cape because a cape is necessary in order to get that secret area in the Donut Ghost House. So let's just do this for now and then we can see what happens later on. So, oh crap, 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 whatever. Haha, <laughs> jumped over. Eat you. Alright. Stupid Goombas. Oh, what are you doing? You, you are fag. Fag. Yeah, what are you do now? Oh, you. Oh, good. Thank God you suck. Oh, shit. Hammer bros. Oh, wow. Hammers are deadly. Okay, so let's let him go that way. Not hit him out. Wait. Wait. Walk that. Oh, you douche tar. Douche tar. I was gonna get one. Oh. Just see, now I just get 8,000 points. That is so dumb. So dumb. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Oh, my crap. This is not gonna probably be. This looks like it's gonna be crappy. <laughs> yeah, not good. Not good so far. Let's uh, let's try this again. I don't know why I'm sucking so bad. So, haha, uh -huh. stole your shell. Okay, all right. Let's just take his shell for now. I can just use this shell to um. Oh crap! I just killed him. Okay, there. I can probably just use this shell actually to uh, do the little area there with uh. Oh, I can't. You can't go up the side when you're holding the object. Good to know. There you go. Whoa, that went right over my head. Oh, God, I missed the flying Goomba. Damn it. That was ridiculous, though. I swear to God I was going to lose that. So, okay, there we go. Kick him. All right, well. He's down the hole now. He's gone. <laughs> Don't need to worry about him. Yes. I'm dead. Jump up. Down the tube? Nope. All right, checkpoint. So we're good to go right now. Let's just make sure I can hopefully get my uh, uh, my uh, my feather, my cape. I want to be able to fly around. So, oh, here we go. We're gonna get the feather out of this. Let's hit it once it gets the feather area. Next one. Yes. Okay. Now be very, very careful. Whoop! That was close. Oh shit! Don't crap. Stupid wing blocks! You don't help me. You're just a pain in the ass. Okay. 
do you... Wait, wait a second. Let's watch, watch Yoshi there. Do... Do I seriously, like, punch him in the back of the head? I think Mario seriously punches Yoshi right in the back of the head to make him spit his tongue out. I think that, that's pretty cruel, isn't it? Well, not really. I don't know. Whatever. But still, that's, that's, that's hilarious, actually. I mean, he's like, BAM! Eyeball! Maybe it's the back of his eye, I don't know. It's pretty large eyes. Shit, be very careful here, because I don't want to lose my cape. There we go, lost Yoshi, damn it. Crap. I think this is the end of the level anyway, though, so this is good, good for us. Oh yes, okay. Cool, alright. So good, good, now, now we can run back to the, um, donut ghost house there, and we can get the secret exit that, at that one. That will give us that special area that I'll show you where you, we can get, um, we'll be able to get some, a feather, as long as I don't do anything stupid here. We'll be able to get the feather that'll let me, um, just up in the top icon. I got the mushroom up there right now, you can see. Um, but this will allow us to get that, uh, that to be a feather, and I can get, like, some extra lives if I want, so. I'll be careful here. Wow! Let's, does this work? Damn it, okay, so star exit didn't work. Uh, crap. Crappy crap. Let's see. I want to see. A start select will exit any level you're in, despite I think completion actually. And you'll actually be able to save your your things that you your power ups and things. I think they. I mean they changed that from the previous versions of games, or I don't want to say the newer versions maybe versus the previous ones. I guess that's not entirely accurate, but I might be able to just um get a feather here and then start and select, which will exit me, so I can have the cape to try it one more time. But I want to make sure um. I will. It's good that we already got the uh, Donut Plains 4 done. So here's start exit, uh, start select. And I do have the cape, so good to go. So let's try this one more time and not be retarded. So, um, and uh, cause I want to try and go uh, beat Morton's castle today. So, okay, there we go. That's better. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to run all the way to the right, then run all the way to the left. Be careful there. And then once you get to the end over here, I'm gonna fly up fly up yeah there you go see now you got the special area here watch out for the ghosts obviously they're a pain in the ass just run all the way back to the right and now you're on the other side of the wall fall down you can hit these and get some fake one-offs but you really don't oh shit. i should just should just went in and you just go in the door and you jump and you don't get any bonus points because you suck but there you go and now we unlock a special area over here um where now i'm gonna get myself a bunch of cape, uh, cape up in my my hold item area, along with um, uh, cape in my uh, other thing. So see, Yoshi's in the middle here for you. Now, if you come back in here with a Yoshi, you'll just get a one up out of the Yoshi spot. But on this side, then you want to hit these ones because those I believe only give you um, those ones just give you the fire flowers if you already have mushroom, and then the ones on the right there, like it just got, were two capes. And then you can continually go in here, and get a bunch of lives, but. You really don't need, need many, too many lives anyway. But now I got capes, which are very helpful. And now we're going to kick Morton's ass. So let's give it a shot. So leave Yoshi at the door. Oh, yes. I love this castle music. So sweet. Oh, watch out. The mini, mini thwompodes or thwomp, thwomp boys. I don't know what you want to call them. But I don't need that anyway. Let's just go in here. There's a real thwomp. Oh, yeah. Okay, watch out. Fireballs, not good. You want to jump over those? <laughs> oh, dry bones! Oh my god! I don't know how he's even living. That's not even possible at all. Which is obvious, but I mean. So, yes, I love twirling! I don't know. Well, you guys probably already know. Yes, I do love my twirling skills, so I would constantly twirl whenever I'm just chilling, but let's get these platforms take forever. They suck. So you can be pro. Pro, yes! Okay, alright. So there's another dry bones. Let's jump on his head. Oh, oh man. Ah! <laughs> Alright, there we go. So we're going up. And we'll just we'll stay on the right side. I don't really need any coins right now. Um, yeah, we're getting a bit low on time anyway. So let's just run up here quick. Hop, hop, hop. Yeah! Oh! Actually, uh, funny thing. Um, I, uh, back in my old high school days there, I actually took a bit of uh, German. And in German, actually, uh, dry bones in German is actually pronounced, uh, Knackentrocken. That's actually freaking hilarious, because it's, like, such... It just sounds so cool, and it totally fits, because dry bones is a pretty sweet character to begin with. So, alright, anyway, we got that. Now we're ready to fight Morton. And 
look at his ugliness. So he's a he's kind of a classic character. You just jump on his head three times. We have to make sure you can time it because he has to take a second while he's there. There you go. Yes. Even better than the last time I played him, which was a long time ago. I remember he had the issues. Otherwise, he normally would claw up the wall there, fall down and hit, and then shake the floor. And then if you were standing there, you'd get stunned then. So then he'd just run right into you and then hurt you again. But that wasn't the case because I'd be able to do three easy knocks. So, oh, we're, uh, we're pretty much done here now, so I'm just going to finish up, read this. Oh, wow, kicking the castle down. That's how sweet. Eggs all like, thank you. So, Morin Koopa Jr. of Castle Number 2 is now just a memory. The next area, the vanilla under the, uh, of, uh, yeah. Wow, the next area is the underground vanilla dome. What traps await Mario in this new world? What will become a Princess Toadstool? We don't know, but we just, we'll figure it out. We'll, we'll kick some butt, so. There we go, unlock the new area. Here's the Vanilla Dome. All right, cool, and I'll see you guys next time, though, for the Vanilla Dome. Peace out.